right now we're going to be looking at Painter 11 by Coral Software and this is just going to be me doing a little tiny rage about the zoom function or an overview and ways that you can solve it by just looking at it in a different way. So let me begin by saying that you want to open up the software and open up a file that's probably around uh, 300 dpi. Anywhere above 150 dpi will give you a great resolution. Alright, let's go ahead and talk about brushes. Brushes are really important. If you want to create your own brush, you're going to want to push Control b Contr Pushing Control b will open up the brush creator and you'll be able to create your own brush. Um, the most important thing is you want to go ahead and create a smooth brush if you're making ink lines and like that. But if you want to use a pencil for sketching like that, it's always going to be a little bit more pixelated when you do zoom in. So take that information for your insanity's sake. If you want the brush that I'm using here, uh, it'll be in the description and I'll give you a link for you to download it. Alright, let's go ahead and check out the pros and cons, the good and bad of Painter 11's zoom function. If you push the letter M, it'll open up the magnifying tool and right there you'll be able to see good increments of zoom percentages that the program can zoom in and out and show good line pixelation resolution rendering whatever you want to call it so 25 33 50 66 75 100 those are all good resolutions but um, the thing about the mouse wheel when zo zooming in is that it skips those increments those zoom percentages and it goes in between them this is bad for some people but it's also good for others because some of us do want to actually edit pixels and sharpen up the bitmap of the stroke line that we created so but compared to the magnifying tool the, which does hit those zoom percentages on the dot um i don't know if creating this video will help convince coral software to put out a patch for painter 11 zoom function in uh, earlier versions of Painter, there were indefinite increments that you could change by going to preferences and the mouse wheel would hit on those specific percentages of zoom. Alright, let me go ahead and talk about this weird thing about Coral Painter 11. I don't know why, but using the method of Control plus to zoom in, you get terrible renderings of the lines. So the thing about this is that it does hit those zoom percentages of you know 25, 33, 50, 66, 7500. But the thing is I would recommend using the magnifying tool to get those zoom percentages instead of control plus. And you can see that at 50% and 100% they're pretty much both the same rendering. But anything other than that, a little bit more pixelated lines. That's pretty much the rage of about uh, Painter 11 that I, I just can't understand but you know like on 50 and 100 you do get those but when zooming in and out um, you always get some demented style of the lines um, I hope you guys found this um, a little knowledge informative